Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure. Welcome back to the Transport Fever 2 mainline. Uh, we're, uh, we're riding on the Bongolia mainline oil lumber line. Yeah, no, this is the one that I tinkered with very early on in the last episode. Uh, just to show that it's working. Of course it's working. Uh, yeah, the trains aren't getting held up at all. And we are starting to get some processed lumber through as well. So some planks are starting to be stored. This is all working gloriously. I was rather hoping we'd see a truck as we pull into the station. But uh, I guess that's just not to be. I'm going to have to hop off the train. I don't want to hop off the train. Well, hop off anyway. All right, hopping. There we go. Hopping off the train. Uh, as you can see, we're picking up, uh, at the moment, still the same old, same old uh, that we always used to. Uh, but now we're starting to get this, uh, this forest here is supplying uh, the yard that goes out towards making some some plankage and uh, this merry young chap here should be bringing in some plankage as well which is absolutely dandy there we go let's let's watch him on his on his merry merry trip through the universe ah super he's got some plankage he's covered in i don't know soot either that or he's got camouflage on just in case there's an invasion due either way i'm not going to question his motives too closely Tell you what, what I'm digging about this truck is the solid state tyres going on there. Those are proper beefcake, big slabs of rubber. And no inner tubes to be seen for miles in any direction. Uh, so that's super. It's not the focus of today's episode. I just thought it'd be nice to catch up on it, you know. So uh, there we go. I'll leave him trundling in that way that things trundle. Ah, oh, there's uh, Dave. Still knows him a tenner. Uh, and that's, uh, that's that sorted then. Over here, how are we getting on? Production's happening. Yeah. Okay. Uh, are the trucks coming in the other way, actually, hauling? Oh, you, yes, they are. Uh, is the line making profit? Yeah. Yeah, I rather think it is. If we call that up, yeah, that's in profit. Yeah, good. Uh, the other one, is that in profit too? Uh, that's the wrong one. You're looking at the wrong... That's the line you just looked at. Okay. Well, look at a different line then. Um, of course it's in profit. It's running freight in both directions. Well, show me. It's not, look. It is now. Ha! Shh. Yeah, okay, barely. There's still, there's still a, there's a bedding in period. Be quiet. Silence yourself. What about the line over here? Oh, this is making major league profit. Three million. Lovely. Uh, good. Right, now, where are, we, where, where are we going? We're going over here. Um, for today's operation, holy moly, there's a lot going on up at this. Sorry, just, uh, just curious as to uh, the efficacy of stuff that I'm running at the moment. Uh, you are running in profit as well. Yeah, you need a bigger train, son. Yeah, well, that's as that's as may be. I think uh, need a bigger train is a motif that we're going to use on a routine basis, but needs must. Right, last time we built this magnificent span of bridge that then winds around the mountain up towards Iron Forge. As you can see, we've got a, uh, a mainline train that's just left the premises. Having dropped off absolutely nothing at all. Uh, well, I mean, the only things it would drop off at the moment would be uh, brick and... Come on. Come on, brain. Is it tools? I want to say tools. It is tools! <laughs> uh, yeah, construction materials and tools, which are the only two things that uh, Ironforge actually desires. Although, saying that, are we in catchment? Yeah, you've got, uh, you've got tool catchment going on there. Uh, have we, though? Oh, yeah. Maybe, maybe even a little bit of... What are you? You Yeah, you've got... Uh, you want bricks. Okay. I mean, a little bit of in-town distribution certainly wouldn't hurt, but uh, it's it's kind of working already at the moment. I'm just going to slap in a little bit of road here. Maybe that will that will broaden out our, uh, our reach ever so slightly. Uh, but I think Ironforge will really come into its own once I start bringing passengers in, and then it will start to grow, and then maybe we'll get a little bit more supply working no you haven't reached any further with that okay well that's not the end of the world today's objectives two two objectives for today uh we'll start with the first one and then we'll do the second one the second one is going to be the steel mill and hooking that up to iron forge at which point that will pop into life uh which will be lovely uh the first one though is uh is to, to reshape this colossal hideous carbuncle uh that we've got going on here Okay, just going to wait for him to get out of the way a little bit more. 
he's got out of the way enough. Get to work. All right, uh, let's go. All right, we already know where we're ending up. That's that's the easy bit, where we're ending up. The, the question is how we get there. Uh, so we don't want to delete the station, so do click carefully. Uh, you know, we uh, we reward careful clickers in, uh, in this department. Uh, give me a fair bit of strength, and then just bring this all up to the same level. And this is purely so I can make the uh, the the connectivity here a little neater. Uh, I'll then uh, I'll then go a little bit uh, a little bit ha uh, smoothing gun happy, and it should all work out. Why are you broadening out so far? Just because it will then feel a little more natural, if you say so. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just a, just a little bit more natural. You understand? Um, there you go. That's probably enough. We don't need to be, you know, stupidly complex with this. The thing is, it would be nicer if these two came out of there, but it doesn't make any sense given that, that line three here very much exists there. Right? See? I mean, that's, you know, that's where it, that's where it lives. And then this just comes out there and we'll transfer the bridge over to be one of those. Yep. Yeah. And go. All right. And then uh, on this one... Same again, only, go on, you're going to have to snap in. There you go, before the bridge starts, and that way it won't look hideous there. I mean, I, did, I didn't advertise that as being anything particularly complex, I just wanted to neaten it up a little bit. Um, yeah. There, I mean, there's a high likelihood, of course, that, that I end up running more train stuff in here in the future. But not today, let's get to the main meat and potatoes of today's quest, which is hooking up the steel mill. Uh, with time permitting, we'll then also uh, we'll also add in maybe uh, a couple of the other mines, but I think this is going to be enough to keep me busy. Now, we could do something tasteful. Do speak of tasteful. We, we, we're, we're very much fans of that in this department. Well, okay, here's, here's kind of what I was thinking. You're underground. But I'm aware that I'm underground. What I was thinking was to loop round underneath one set of pillars, come out underneath another set, where we'll be, I guess, half the height there at that point, uh, then follow around, mirror the tunnel, and uh, and link up at this station, which I have a horrible feeling I'm about to demolish, and then, and then thread onto the main line to go the rest of the distance. That would be quite tasteful. The question, though, is the is in the loop itself. Is as you saw there. I mean, going uphill at that kind of pace, you've uh, you've got not a lot of choice in the matter when it comes to tunnels, unless you you unless we gouge it, which will look like that. Ew. Yeah, ew is right. Or we rebuild it. No, no, no. no. Look, you have, you've got it flush with the with the the mine the mill, whatever it is. Uh, so, all right, let's try it. I'm going to try this really sketchily, uh, and then we'll we'll try it in a less sketchy fashion in a moment. All right, yeah, okay. So then you what? You want to go round like that while continuing uphill, and then round again. Yeah. All right. I'm I'm almost certain going to delete all of this, but I want to just see what it does. I mean that's the that's the advantage of having tons of money is you can you can do stuff that you're going to go how how terrible does this actually look? There you go, then come out over there. That's nice. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Go on. Then keep going. I might even I might even stick with it. We don't know. So you've come out like that. Yeah. It hasn't made a radical difference, has it? We can't afford a double helix, surely. Well, we can afford it monetarily. Can we afford it stylistically? Uh, and that comes down to... If we now go straight uphill, can you get... You can. You can merge onto the onto the line there. Now, I wouldn't want to do that. I'd want to add a, a separate uh, platform to, to run through. There's an awful lot of tunnel going on there, but I don't think it's. I don't think we can avoid that. The, I mean, the alternative is tunnel a heck of a long way this way before curving round and into the station. Now, there's a lot less drama involved in that, but it does mean it's going to be a heck of a lot more profitable. 
I mean, as it is, I'm probably going to end up running two, three trains on here. Well, that's cute then. Yeah, it is. Are you happy with that? No, I think we can do better. All right, so do better. All right, okay, here we go. Yep, brace yourselves there, fans of the bulldoze noise. Uh, right, let's take out from about there. Yeah. I would have taken out earlier, but a tree got in the way and saved a bit of track. I might change my mind, but hold on. Let's, uh, let's get in and, uh, and get it. Just keep clicking till it's gone. Trees are mere casualties of progress. Uh, right, okay. Now, if you were to then come out this way, keep going up, but let's have a... Why are you, why are you going for minimum curve here? Have I got just a, a weird angle going on? There you go. Go a little bit further out. Uh, and then over this way. Well, no, no, straight line-ish. Yeah, like so. Yeah. You are going to need to double track this. We do not want any queuing going on in this uh, in this department. And then narrow that in a smidge. I just think that there's the opportunity that this is going to look better, you see. No, no downhill for you. Keep going up. Uphill is the important bit. You giant pain in my backside. There we go. Come on. There you go. Ah, that's the stuff. Right. And then... Bring that out to about here. Yes. Give it the tasteful moderns. Tasteful moderns deployed. Although that's hidden the tick box now. There you are. There. Give me that. Right. You haven't quite got that angle right. Yeah, I know, but it still might end up looking uh, passable. And then you bring it out over there. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, um... That's, if anything, that's too aggressive. I don't think you need to be. There you go. That's that's nice. That Actually, that is nice. Yeah, you've got the opportunity for seeing multiple trains, and it'll look like they're part of the same line, but of course they won't be. Yeah, all right. I'll allow it. Uh, yeah, let's go. Now, how sharp is this corner? Can I get can I get a second line on the inside? I want to go on the inside of that one. Well, the only way we're going to find out is... I mean, well, okay, look. We know for fact that when you when you do any kind of a line split inside a tunnel, if you view it first person, it looks wretched. The plus side is, if you don't look at it first person, you are completely oblivious to how wretched it looks. All right, yeah, keep going. Yeah. I mean, if we've got the demand, and we might, we might, we'll certain. What? What? I'm sorry, I got stuck. Um, we may well have sufficient demand to run four, five trains on this line. Um, the important thing is that they're all carrying uh, a near max load of iron and coal on the way down because the, the steel's just going to take care of itself. The steel's just going to produce and, and you'll, you'll hoik some back up the, the side of the hill. What do you think about that? I'd be happy if it was height parallel as well, but we have no choice but to continue the climb. Yeah, okay. All right, now then, next job is... Uh, sorry, friend. Yeah. All right, and then uh, sorry to you, friendo, as well. All right, there they are, that's it. Bit more? Just, uh, well, yeah, give it a little bit. You might go, why are you taking those out? Aren't they going to be useful? They are going to be useful, but I don't know where yet. Uh, give me this, crank it up to uh, a level that could be described as flamboyant, and uh, and push it. Yeah. Actually, if we push this bit as well, we can have a little bit less tunnel going on there. Okay. Giving it some reshaping. It. You didn't reshape outside Failywood. Oh, I meant to, didn't I? Yeah, but you didn't. No, but I meant to. Uh, and then, let's... Well, look, I grabbed from there. Why are you now... Don't... No, don't be like that. Okay, all right, well, it's fine. I'll fix it. There you go. There you are. See? That's not so bad, is it? Uh, right, now, Blatina Station. Uh, yeah, one of those. Now, we had a three in there before. Are we going to merge that second line onto the main line before, before or after? Oh, well, 
That's the age-old question we all try to answer. What about going four tracks? No, four tracks you don't need. It's going to either be five or three. Let's go five. All right? For the sake of pure adventure. Uh, yeah, okay. Pure adventure is certainly one of my favourite things. Yeah, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. Hey, why are you fighting me so egregiously here? Uh, give it a... There you go. Sit there and then just enough. Don't try and snap. Thank you. There. Okay, well, that's moderately interesting. Yep. Okay. All right. We have created moderately interesting. Now, that means that uh, the secondary line here, it's got plenty of plenty of, root, uh, plenty of room to make this work. So you're going to come up like so. What's that there? That's the main line. Okay. All right. Well, now, hold on. We'll, we're going to need to reroute that a smidge. So... Uh, Let's do that first. Keep going till you get a bit. There you go. That's it. And some more. Yeah. And a bit more. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And some more. Yeah. Yeah. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm making it happen. There we go. Right. Okay. Cool. Uh, now, do the main line first, and then you won't be sad if, if everything is dramatic. I might be sad if everything is dramatic. Yeah, what are you going to do about that hillside? I think I have to knock more of it out in order to make it, you know, potentially... Ugh. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yes. What are you, six? Uh, <laughs> ugh, don't like that. Uh, wait, wait, wait. You're just putting it back in again. Just That's that's halfway... What happened there? I don't know. Oh, well, there we go. It's the autosave. Just made it all go a little bit... And then, then it was all... Ah... And we're all fine as a result. Uh, which side are you? It looks like your right-hand side. So you would emerge about there. Yeah. And then this one would uh, trundle in this direction. Yeah. Have a look at it. Uh, yeah. You're going to have to fix that line, though. Really? You don't think it will pick up the, the, the new platform numbers? Yeah. Also... Just, you know, just saying, just putting that out there. But uh, yeah, your angle of attack here is no good to anybody. I disagree. Yeah, I had a feeling you might. Uh, let's go for this. Yeah, I know. People watching are going, no, he's, he's done the wrong one there. I go, no, 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 I haven't. I haven't. This is, uh, this is intentional. Um, and then, yeah, fix the ground. Sorry, I'm starting to get starting to get immersed in my own thoughts rather than uh, rather than keeping the commentary running. Let's keep the commentary running. Well, a funny thing happened to me the other day. There you go. That's it. Just talk about something random while you're putting this together. I've got nothing on my mind. That's the thing. I've got nothing random I can really talk about. Okay. All right. Well, just do the do the necessary, Charmaine. Do the necessary, Charmaine. Yeah. Now, if you know that reference, you've done well. I mean, that, that one very much is British. Um, and it's from the 1980s. Uh, but there you go. Right. Do the necessary. I like that. Uh, right, okay. So, this is the... Obviously, this is the mainline switch out here. Uh, and then I'll probably put a switch out from that. Ooh, that's tasteful. Yeah. Over onto there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that is moderately tasteful. Uh, let's uh, double slip all of this wherever possible, just to make sure that we can get where we're going. That appears to have fixed the route. Yeah, but I don't believe that. Uh, show me lines. No, there you go. Uh, okay, all right. No, it's, it has done exactly as prescribed. Um, all right, and then we'll, then we'll throw this down to here. All right, is that the right side? No, it's not. That's the wrong side. All right, well, connect to the right side. I have done. The right side, which obviously, in this case, is the left side. If you're not confused already, you're welcome. Uh, all right, uh, grab, go. Hope that tidies that up. It hasn't. Do it all again. All right. Just, if you two were the same flipping length to begin with, it would make life a heck of a lot easier. All right, do this over here. No, that's no, that's disgusting. Uh, do it, do it again, but better. There you are. 
There we are. Right, okay, that's it. It's all working now. Then you run up there like so. Now, obviously, we've got the we've got the option to stop off at this ore mine on the way, but I don't think I'm going to. I think I will run that as a separate entity, which might be a bit odd, um, but it does mean that we've, we're going to have a clear load uh, coming out of Ironforge. Because uh, if we were to... If we were to put in a stop running down the mountain here at the, the, the iron mine, um, if the train's already full, then this mine is just going to fill up in perpetuity. Whereas if we, uh, if we fling the line up to the frog here, uh, then it's, it's more likely to work. It is. Trust me, it is. It's, it's more likely to be, to be viable. Right, we've got five platforms available to us. I'm going to need two. One for the iron mine, or at least... I could use one for the iron mine and one for the steel mill. Uh, it's all going to need to merge together. Now this diamond here, in the fullness of time, becomes superfluous. But for the moment, it's it's needed because we're we're turning around the trains on the on the main line. So we'll uh, we'll instead we'll run a double switch off here. Yeah. Okay. Right. Now, those, those are fine because those are basically going to be backing tracks. So uh, let's say, for the sake of argument, that we have the, uh, the ore train comes in on one, then the steel train in on two. Uh, they just need to be able to get to both sides of the track, which means slipping this switch. Yep, okay. And then we should be okay. Yeah. Hang on. If you're coming out of this one... You're gonna need another. You're gonna need another. You're gonna need a another. All right. Okay. I'll do it here. It's it's dirty, but I have a feeling that I'm gonna be running a heck of a lot more lines into this station. So there's a. It's not even a chance. It's a very high level of certainty that that's going to evolve further. All right. All right. Bang in some signal, and uh, and we'll we'll work from there. Right. You are one way. Yeah. And then we'll uh, we'll. Oh, I don't. As luck would have it. Yeah. We're already set. Are we? Yeah. 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 Maybe move this one out to a little closer to the junction. And uh, and we should be golden. Potentially. All right. Stick that on there. Well, why would you do that? Don't you mean there? I do. All right. Okay. Then leave the rest of it alone for the moment. Because I want to see how the queues form probably need signaling on here but there is the risk of no 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 because this is two-way track in which case one there and one there all right great okay that's going to work yeah all right so let's set up the lines and set it rolling uh yes yeah let's let's do that where are we iron forge oh new places all right from uh, Ironforge 2, whatever we call that. Ironforge transfer. Okay, well, this is obviously going to be called iron. Yeah, ML. Yeah, rail. Yes, iron. Yeah, supply. One. I have a feeling there will be more than one. Uh, and that's gone into platform one. Okay, cool. And then the next one, Ironforge down to... Yeah, that's, that's an interesting line. Uh, so this is iron, yeah, ML, yeah, rail, mm -hmm. steel, ooh, production, ah, okay, groovy. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm very much, I'm very much into it. Uh, we can fire the trains we need out of an existing depot, but our existing depot isn't it all the way in Ironfort? No, in uh, the Dark City. No, you built another one. Are you sure? Yeah, I, I, I definitely built another one that was a little closer. But where, though? Yeah, because we're, we're f certainly likely to be far enough away from everything that we could we could probably have another depot there. Now, there we go. Here we go. It's, it's, it's at Miranda. Oh, that's not so far. No, that's fine. Okay, right. What do we want? Trains. When do we want them? Next 10 minutes or so. Uh, let's go. Steam. Yes. Oh, have we got an electric yet? Yeah, nope. I think it's 1920 for the first electric. I'll unpause again, because uh, we're at 1918 right now. 
okay. What do you do? What are you for? Uh, trough. The period of service on the FS. Don't know what that is. Uh, most of the GR200 were reformed, adding a third axis to the te axis. Why not? Uh, to the tender. Axle, surely. Uh, and also changing the numbering of the locomotive. Uh, those little locomotives remain in service until the 1940s, always being used for cargo purposes. Right then, Sunshine, I'm going to use you for cargo purposes. Come on in. Add it. Uh, yeah. And then what? Cargo. Yeah. And uh, gondolas. All right. How many do you want? Oh, a shake. How's the, how's the power rating on, on hills? You're already starting to lose it. Oh, flipping heck. Yeah. How is it now? You're still, yeah, you're still okay. Capacity's 96. That's probably about right. Okay. Get yourself to work there, son. Uh, iron. Yes. ML. Supply 1. Cool. Right. For the second train, I think we're going to need something a little bit more beefy. And I'm going to want a couple of them. I'm going to start with two. Are you? I'm going to start with three. There you go. China China Railways. I don't think that's... I don't know. That's not our puppy, that one. That's a little bit too swift. What about Mikados? They certainly get the job done. Yeah. This this does look like it will probably do... Uh, this will probably do the job, you know. And we haven't used them yet. All right. China number one. Ah, uh, let's go there. And then let's naffies this bad boy up. Yeah, yeah, this will this will do it. Yeah, all right. How, many, how much have we got there? Right, it's gone to mediocre. High, it drops to fifty-five. You can probably get one more on there and not lose any sleep. Uh, it's now doing fifty-three. Well, yeah, one forty-four. That's that's a reasonable shake there, you know. Yeah, but I have a feeling that we're going to be we're going to be hauling a heck of a lot of uh, uh, of goods down there. All right. Okay, well, okay, here's our candidate for the new most expensive line to run uh, in terms of not making me any money at all. Iron supply, steel production. Part of me says you just put the old one on steel production. Which part of you? The part that is fearful of getting it wrong. You have a part that's fearful of getting it wrong? No, not really. Um, yeah. Are you coming or what? You would do if you had any signals to play with. Well, look, I'll put a signal on there. Uh, where are you? Where are you actually going to come out? I just want to. I just want to interrogate you so that I can see who you are and why you're why you exist. Well, look, just go mad. Go mad for signals. There you go. Just do that. Just make sure it's on the right line, and then then we'll all be pleased. Ish. All right, you are going to iron supply. No, you did put it on the right one. Nice whistle. Very good. Big times. Yeah. I mean, it is a little bit smaller than the gondolas it's pulling. Uh, pulling? Pulling. But uh, hey-ho. Now then, how's the, uh, how's the queuing situation here these days? Because I know that the, the station here at, uh, at Miranda is jam-packed with business. If I up the tempo, apologies for upping the tempo, but I want to I see how quickly it can find its way onto the line. Given that, Miranda is jam-packed with business. Yeah, I mean, the, the good news is that we might be starting to build up a little bit of... Uh, uh, a bit of coal and a bit of iron at, uh, at Ironforge, waiting for me to get my life in order. Yeah. But if he can't, if he can't get out of this depot, then in, uh, nobody's life is ever going to be in order. Ever. Yeah. I love it. I, I love how busy it is. Now? No. No, passenger train. Um, okay. I don't think that is a passenger train. I think you might be right. Yeah. Okay. Right. What about now? Now feels good. Come on. Come all off. No. Look, if you're waiting for mainline trains to leave you a little gap, it's never going to happen. My assumption is what he wants to do is he, he's trying to get up here swing across and then hike it up the mountain that's that that would be my guess as to what he's trying to accomplish 
Yeah. But you see, you've built... Oh, no, no, we're away. Okay, cool. Right. Ride it. Ride it. Okay. Yeah. All right. I am going to ride at a high speed, so uh, enjoy your time on the roller coaster. And that's purely because we've got a reasonable distance to go here. Uh, but I just want to... I just want to ride the route, you know? Uh, flipping signals. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah. I can see a dodgy bit of track in the tunnel here. Really? A do you and a dodgy piece of track? Surely not. Yeah, I know. It does happen. Uh, and, you know, but sometimes we're comfortable with that. There you go. There's a train. Yeah. Running perilously fast in a reverse reversal direction. Uh, several people pointed out that my, uh, my I, I can't remember if it's the clockwise or anti-clockwise route uh, that's, uh, that's serving passengers, is going to always run backwards until I take all those trains, stuff them into a depot, flip them round, and then they will always run forwards. This is true. We're away! Okay. All right, good. Now, the fact that we're getting up here means that I don't have to worry about those uh, those steel trains getting up here because they too will eventually find a, a gap that they can uh, they can exit through. We're doing 20 kilometers an hour. Go Tarzan. All right, come on, we're away. Yeah, this is odd because this is an uphill section and we've just come downhill. That first bit of line there, it does, a, it does something unnecessary. But that's okay. I, this is the, the problem with building track piecemeal rather than doing big long swathes of track is that uh, you do end up in a situation where uh, where, there, where lumps have just turned up despite the fact you thought you were climbing at a fairly steady rate. Yeah. Train? Yeah. I mean, what else do you expect? I know. The gap between this and the next signal is quite a lengthy one. Yes. Is that okay? Oh, it shouldn't have been. There's only a signal here. Okay, well, we're clearly following something slow then. Yeah, we really are. Uh, I mean, that's not a deal breaker or anything, but it shouldn't be that slow. We're only, I mean, we're only getting up to twenty or so kilometers per hour once we're once we're actually rolling. Uh, could be uh, unequal distances from signal to signal. Yeah, that's that's certainly plausible. We'll probably wait here as well. Yep. No, we're not. We're through. Okay. Well, we didn't get the go signal. No, but we're going anyway. All right, then. Yeah. You were looking at the wrong signal. Oh, uh, no, was I? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Good to go. All right. Thank you. Yeah, we're away. Presumably, we're going to... Uh, because we we have been crossing over with the, uh, with the passenger line, uh, as well as the main line, and once we're only in competition with the main line, I'm looking forward to replacing those with electric signals. Just, I mean, look at all this semaphore action going on. You're going, I don't know what I'm looking at. It's terrifying. Uh, all right, okay, now we're, now we're getting somewhere. No, we're not. Oh, curses. It's going to be fine. Bus. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're cutting through the passengers. No, 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 passenger side's the other side. Oh. Where the heck am I? This is a nice station. Uh, Citadel. Is it? Yeah, I think so. Alright, okay. Um, right, yeah. Motoring now. Yes. Now we now we move. Presumably we're on the freight main line at this point. I would have thought so anyway. Well, we'll see if we pass another train. There you go. Yes, we are. Fine. In which case, those other two lines must surely be the passenger line. You would think. You would hope. Uh, uh, right, so next up should be Failure Woods. That's the Failure Wood passenger station. Are you sure? I'm really not, but that's because... I mean, that's mostly because I've not ridden this section of track before. I like to ride the tracks, you know. I think what I ought to do at some point is just do a, a live stream where we do nothing but ride the track. Yeah, obviously not a high speed like this. We'll, we'll take our time and, uh, you know, maybe fix a, a bit or two along the way. That could be nice. Yeah, I'm sure people would like that. When are you planning to do it then? I have no idea. 
Okay, now now we're on to the now we're on to the new stuff. So here's the uh, the, the ruddy great viaduct that was constructed. We've got a uh, have we got a helix on this bit. No, it's the uh, it's only the underside that has the helix. See downhill, yeah, big downhill drop. Whoa, lose your stomach, and then back uphill again. Yeah, I know, but you see, the thing is that I wanted to keep the bridge span relatively short and make sure that we had uh, opportunities for cheeky tunnelling on the way up. That'd be quite. That'd be a spectacular view if it wasn't the edge of the map. Yep. Okay. We got. What's this king call about? This will be where I will have changed my mind about the track layout, and it's more or less smoothed it out, but not perfectly. Okay, this is going to be the scene of... A, there's a lot of iron waiting there. That's great. Yeah, I suppose it is. Need some signals there. Yep. Okay. Yeah, no, no, it's all, it's all good. You sure you need some signals there? Yeah, well, I probably do, but not in, not in an obvious way. Anyway, we're coming up on our destination. And uh, and here we are at Ironforge. Super. There was a little bit of freight waiting there. Not a lot of freight, you understand, but a little bit. Yeah, see, look. Two whole bins. No, four. Four, beg your pardon. Four whole bins waiting there for a, for a train to come and make merry. Okay, I just want to see what the, uh, what the full load looks like once we've got it. Oh, I mean... Not what it looks like particularly. I want to see what the performance of the train is. More than anything else. But also I want to ride this all the way down to the... Uh, it is not, it's not riding down to anything. This is not the platform you want. No. No, I should be on a, I should be on a segregated platform here. Otherwise this is going to happen. Okay. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. I thought I put a 5 on it. You did put a 5, but you didn't connect it up. Ah, uh, yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, you did. All right, okay. In that case, it's it's simply a case that you're on the wrong flipping platform. You should be on platform 5. Like that. There you go. All right. Yeah, no, thanks for that. No, it's okay. It'll all work out. I assume you've got a, uh, a double. Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I made it happen. All right, don't let that happen again. And do put some signals on. Uh, one there. Yeah, one here. Yeah. Oh, what did you just do? Well, somehow in placing a signal there, you confused the heck out of that train. Well, just turn it around. All right. It's not going to do it, though. There you go. Right. And then turn it around again. All right. There we go. Yeah. I placed the signal and the, tr uh, the train jumped back, which it should not have... Well, it, it does that. That's, I mean, that's how, the, that's how the game likes to do things. It keeps, it keeps itself excited. Uh, is a mainliner coming up? Super. Yeah, okay. Now, until I start... Uh, that is coal. The main line's bringing coal in for me, which is jolly decent of it. Uh, but I'll be running in my own, and that's what we shall attend to in the next episode. The aim will be... Uh, connect up, ooh, what? This, yeah, that, righto. This, mm, that, okay. Where's your next, uh, where's your next main line stop? Moss Eisley. Okay, so yeah, so we'll just take all of this iron production materials and, uh, and bring them on into the station. Everything else, all of this oil production materials and, and so forth, we'll stick in Moss Eisley. Cute. Okay. I've been Colonel Failure, everybody. Uh, tune in next time for further adventures of an adventurous nature. Uh, and uh, I look forward to seeing you there. Oh, here comes the uh, the steel train. Yippee. Well, I think yippee's maybe overselling it a little bit. But uh, I, think, I think a good O would, would probably suffice there. Yeah. Now, as much as we're going to be sat on the rear wagon here, we'll, we'll follow this down. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time. Cheerio.